As an example of a dynamic calibration, the 2017 F-150 has similar required testing operations. This vehicle contains a forward-facing camera used to detect the position of the vehicle within the lane. The camera alignment procedure is required for the lane keeping alert and lane keeping aid to function correctly and requires approximately 10 minutes of driving above 40 miles per hour to complete, assuming ideal roadway conditions. Traffic, speed limits, and weather conditions such as snow or rain are all variables that can impact the ability to reach appropriate speeds or identify lane markings or signs. This operation should be performed after windshield replacements, after a change in tire size, after suspension repair or alignment, after front airbag deployment, and after interior mirror replacement. Honda requires a drive to calibrate the tire pressure monitoring system. The calibration is completed after driving in an ideal driving condition for about 20 minutes, between 22 and 65 miles per hour, driving steadily without much acceleration or deceleration. Full functionality of the system cannot be performed if the calibration is not completed. On a 2016 Chrysler 200, the adaptive cruise control module requires a reset for safety system alignment. Requiring a test drive to test for completion and reactivate the adaptive cruise control system. In this drive, the vehicle must be driven above 41 miles per hour as the radar detects common roadside objects. For Tesla vehicles with second generation autopilot, the calibration process on the forward facing camera can take up to 100 miles of manual driving, depending on the road type and condition. Especially for vehicles with owner notifications, it's important that consumers understand you may need to have their vehicle on the roadway for extended periods of time as part of the repair process.